All right. Now, I know that most people nowadays would use this weapon right here. Because as you can see on the stats of this thing, it's pretty good. It has a 90 recoil direction, which is why it's so good. It has really good range and all right stability. Same with the handling perk, I guess, if you look at it that way. But what if I told you there's something better? Hmm? Would you believe me? Because, you know, if you play ARC, let's say, it's quite the arc -y season. I got this thing. Now, if you look at the range and the stability, the stability is better. And if I put on the right mod now, this, I have a 95 recoil direction. So the only thing that's slightly worse is the range and the handling. <coughs> but that's fine, because the handling will be fixed like this. So now I've basically max handling. The only thing that's slightly worse is the range. But I can also fix that. If I play alone, I can pop this perk on. It increases the range, stability, and everything, basically, if you're playing alone. And this works in PvP. So now I basically have, style-wise, a better gun than No Time. But the real question is, is if it actually keeps up with No Time itself. Because I will do two games with Messenger, and I will do one game with No Time. I just want to see the difference. But... If you like my content, make sure to like and subscribe, leave a comment, and do what you have to do. I'm not going to talk too much, I'll just send us into the video. Alright, keep in mind though, I will show this off in control, so it might be different depending on how well your matchmaking is. But this thing is snappy as fuck, as you might see. But this really just works with arc, or with void if you want uh, real stability. RV had the new one. That was a weird angle. I feel like there's no one on the outside, which is annoying because I need the range to make this gun work a lot better. Oh my god, the Monarch. One gun that should be fucking illegal in this game. Wait, Aikilo shotgun? I've never seen anyone use that in a decade. Holy fuck. You know, I heard that sound and I was like, why does that sound so familiar? What the fuck is that? I don't think an auto has ever killed me that fast. I need to do something while I wait these five minutes. I don't know. The matchmaking is just so long right now. But I mean, I can look at the rolls you can get on this gun. Instead of light mag, I could have gone ricochet rounds, which would have increased my stability even more. But then again, it's too bad you can't get this gun no more. This is basically what I would want on this thing. Uh, you can see I don't have a moving target, I have outlaw. Which is unfortunate. But this is probably what I would have gotten on this thing. And this should, in theory, be better than a no time if you take away the exotic perk. And as you can see on no time to explain, you have quite a bit of range. That's the only thing this thing is packing more, it's range. Except for that, I would take my messenger over this thing every day. Oh, oh, oh. Now this is unfortunate, I was supposed to be rocking a fitting aspect throughout this video. Also, you guys need to keep this in mind. My aim is pretty bad compared to better players, so... That is one thing you, you need to keep in mind when you watch this video. See, I'm trying to show off this pulse rifle, but... I did not see him at all. I don't know why.
I couldn't see him, bro. What is his angle? Oh, rip bozo. <laughs> he was just sitting there. I missed that? Damn. <laughs> I'm getting tea back. <laughs> oh, that's funny. If you're wondering what I'm using on my fun verdict, this is my role. It's alright. It's nothing too special. I wish I got surplus over unrelenting, but it works. Now the real gun I'm going to show of this now is this no time to explain. What the fuck is that, bro? Bro, I just don't have the mental capacity to play a 6v6 I think right now. Holy shit. Like, I don't give a shit if I lose or win, but I just don't care to try hard. That's the thing. And it's just annoying when everyone's playing a fucking sweat tourney out here. Like, I've seen so many people butthurt over losing a control game. In my own game, like, they always enter team chat and be like, Why aren't you capping zones? And I'm like, because it's just a control game, who cares? And then they're like, fuck you! And then he leaves. Well, <laughs> I don't really want to continue playing this shit, so I'm gonna end the video here. Hopefully you like it, and uh, I'll see you around.